<clears throat> What's up, Saiyan Army? Now, as you can see from the video, this is gonna be a little bit of a different type of video for you guys. And this is the type of video that I kind of want to be doing a little bit more often where I kind of just open up to the camera, give you guys some input on where, you know, the channels at, where I'm at, and you know, what kind of content and things to be expecting from this channel. And I know I make the, one of these videos like every year and I never stick to it. And I always say that I'm going to work on it, but I promise you guys, I will work on it. This isn't just another one of those type of videos. Now, first off, no, this video is not clickbait. However, no, I'm not quitting YouTube, but I am quitting the How to Train Like Baki series. Now, reason being is COVID. Gyms are still closed. A lot of things are still closed here. It really sucks, but that's one of the reasons. It's just making it really hard to film and to train. Yes, I still love to train. Yes, I still am going to train and I am going to get better. However, the filming and making the series, I'm just going to quit it right now for the time being. Which leads me into my second point. Now this, I absolutely hate talking about and that is the views. Now, as you guys know, my channel, I think, is over 700,000 su subscribers. On the come up to 800,000 and to a million, as a lot of you OG subscribers know that my lifetime goal was to get a million subscribers. The reason being is I just wanted to, as a person, have that kind of impact. I understand the secret to living is giving and my way of giving back, it would be the sub subscriber count. I want to be able to impact that many people, a million people, to at least hit the subscribe button. They don't know they don't have to watch every single video. Obviously, a lot of people don't watch all my videos. However, just to be able to hit that subscribe button and impact them in some type of positive way, whether it's fitness content, or diet content, transformations, that kind of thing, or just animate to put a smile on your face. However, you know, obviously my views go really up and down. And I think a lot of it is because this channel was 100% fitness prior to, you know, me moving back to Hawaii. I believe up to like maybe two, 300,000 subscribers was 100% fitness. And then I moved to anime and I think that's why I, we have a big shift of anime people who is probably like bigger than the fitness people now but we have a lot of people in the in the middle which is very niche as you guys know not everyone that watches anime works out not everyone that works out watches anime but yeah we are that niche that likes to watch it and got inspired by it and started working out and ascending through it and that brings me to right now i appreciate all you guys taking the time out of your day you know you guys could be watching anime but you guys are here you know catching up with my life and the channel and just everything and i just want to say i really love and appreciate you guys for doing that also the next point i want to talk about is panda now i know every single video a lot of you guys mention him i know a lot of you guys want him on the channel and want him in the videos but, you know, he just doesn't want to film anymore. I've asked him to film and he is he, has, he just doesn't want to film anymore. So you guys will not see him on the channel anymore moving forward. So please stop asking and please just do me a favor. And if people do ask, let them know. Just because I know everyone won't see this video and people will still ask regardless. So just do me a favor and, you know, let them know. You know, it's nothing personal with me or him. We're still friends. However, yeah, he just doesn't really, um, just doesn't want to film anymore. And yeah, it's totally fine. All right, and the next point, a question that I get asked a lot is what happened with the Saiyan Aesthetics clothing line, the Saiyan Army clothing line. And basically, I put it on hold for this whole year. I kind of came into this year not exactly sure where I wanted to take it, but I kind of wanted to bring it back and revive it and kind of just change it and do it differently. I wasn't quite happy with how it launched and just the way it was going and just the, I guess the identity of the brand. I wasn't happy with it. So I think as everything comes down, this is something I'm, I'm gonna revisit later on and really think about. However, I do have some collab stuff in the works with Alpha Clothing. So make sure to stay tuned. It is super sick. It is this collab shirt I've wanted to bring out for probably a few years now. Like I was gonna bring it out on, our, on the Saiyan Aesthetic clothing line, then I decided to keep it for an Alpha collab. And yeah, it's just been with all the craziness, been really backed up, but I think it's finally coming to fruition. So stay tuned guys. Alpha's doing their best to get it out as soon as possible. So hopefully I'll have a sample to show you guys very soon. All right, so just closing out this video, one last thing is I do have a new body recomp Saiyan gains program coming out to you guys no that is not the name however 
yeah, it's pretty much a body recomp program. It's gonna help you lose fat, build muscle, obviously depending on your circumstance. And I'm gonna give you guys pretty much all the tips and all the information and the knowledge to find out where you are, where your starting point is, and how to go about it, and what I think is the best way to go on your process of ascending without gaining too much fat, without looking bad, and looking great throughout the entire process. So stay tuned for that. I'm working my ass off. I'm really, really trying to get it out before Christmas and before the new year. These ebooks take so much time. However, they're so rewarding once they're done. They help so many people. So I'm not trying to rush it. I'm trying to do it as best as possible. So I'm putting in a lot of time. Know that behind the scenes, I'm working my balls off, my dragon balls off but that program's gonna be epic, so stay tuned for that. I just wanna thank you guys for watching, you know, as we ascend, as we grow to a million subscribers, as we get these views up, as we change up the content, yes, you know, new anime content coming soon. I will be vlogging a lot more as well. Yes, I wanna open up, and that's something that's been on my goals, and something that I struggle with for like my whole life. I struggle it with like friends, family, just everyone. And it's the same thing with YouTube. I always struggle like opening up and, you know, making myself vulnerable in front of the camera. That's what it comes down to. I think last year was the most vulnerable I ever was when I went through my injury. And yes, it killed lots of my momentum on the channel as well. Uh, but that's really one of my goals. And that's gonna take just me as a person just getting better it's not just you know me and the YouTube camera it's, it's gonna be like me and just everyone I know and just for me as a person just getting better at just opening up and being real but I'm gonna finish this year strong regardless you know this has been a shitty year and I know it sucks for I know it probably sucked the worst for a lot of you guys you know and I'm sorry that you know Actually, I'm not sorry it happened because, you know, like I said, it's not it's nothing we can't control, you know. However, I can tell you this, though. A lot of people are going to come out of 2020 stronger than fucking ever. Because as I say and as I preach in every single video, you know, no matter how many times you get knocked down, sins always get back stronger. Anyways, I've been ranting a long time. I just want to say I really, really appreciate all you guys watching, all you guys that stayed and made it to the end. I got you know a whole lot of love for you guys do me a favor just like the video drop a comment and let me know what's the biggest thing that you took away from 2020 or learned or what's one way that 2020 has made you a better person and if you haven't found that yet then we will we will just keep pushing through keep ascending and yeah let's keep going see you guys in the next video much love strength and honor aloha